Talk Nation, Talk Nation, salute. Welcome back, everybody, man. Good morning. Apparently, we got some breaking news. The injury that Billy Joe suffered in the Canelo Alvarez fight has been classified as a quadrupod injury. Now, there's a bone right on the side of the eye right here. You know what I'm saying? So if you look at a diagram without the human skull, any flesh or anything like that, you're just looking at the skull, it's a bone right there on the side. Now, that bone, different aspects of the, of the skull is actually attached to that bone. Now, what makes Billy Joe Saunders' injury so severe is that in that region, he sustained something called an ocular blowout. Now, if you look at the circumference of the, um, the ocular bone, the bones around that area, now, those bones were damaged, you know what I'm saying, to the point where it could possibly be some damage to the eye. Now, that's what makes the injury so severe because that can be career ending. Now, Kel Brook had to get reconstructive surgery. He had plates put in his eye from the damage that he sustained, kind of like in the frontal area. But being as though Billy Joe Saunders' injury to that bone, quadrupod bone, and what they means by quadrupod, quad is four. And that's four different sections attached to that bone. So with the damage to that bone, those other areas are also affected. So with the surgery, you don't know if that area going into future fights, how much damage that area can take. <clears throat> so <clears throat> this is what makes it so detrimental for Billy Joe Saunders as far as his career possibly being affected by this injury because this is boxing. Now, when you sustain injuries like that, you get what you call scar tissue also. So in future fights, if you take damage from these, excuse me, in these areas or in this region of the ocular zone, you know what I'm saying? Now, that could potentially cause damage. That's why in the Terrence Crawford fight, when he fought Kell Brook, that's why I told you guys, go back and watch the videos, man. While you're at it, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. They're not going to allow him to take too much damage because of the injuries that he sustained in previous fights, meaning to his orbital bones. And moving forward, it will be the same way with Billy Joe Saunders. Now you're going to have to be careful and be mindful of the damage that he basically, you know what I mean, sustains to the um, that side of his face. If that damage begins to get too bad, now the ref is going to have to step in and call it off because why? Sustained damage could possibly cause Billy Joe Saunders to lose his sight, possibly in that eye, you know what I'm saying, because that region was previously damaged. So, fight fans, stay tuned, man, you know what I mean? Just had to bring that to you guys because I actually seen um, a doctor break down that report, so I just wanted to bring that to the people, man. Hopefully, I did my job and did my best to break that down. But the injury is definitely a quadrupod injury. You guys can look that up. Do your research as well. Man, it's your boy, Real Talk Live Sports, a.k.a. the Gallo Stephen A., man. Catch y'all on the next one. Peace. Salute.